and we also, you know, recently we had a rapper in the game, Takashi Six Nine. Uh, Terrible. <laughs> you know, he kind of just insulted and disrespected a lot of niggas in the game for, nothing, for nothing. about a year and a few months. Being as disrespectful as he possibly could, that shit, bro. being loudmouthed as as he possibly could, and everything went to shit. Uh, and now as they came out, he will be cooperating on his team. You know, his whole team got took down. Basically, in the situation, it's a video of him saying he got a thirty pack on. Chief Keith cousin and partner Tato. I don't know if that's his official cousin. I know they're close. Uh, Tato. And that shit got to the courtroom. And now Takashi 69 is flipping and putting everything on the rest of the gang. Saying, hey, you know. We don't, we didn't, if we don't got all the documents yet, but the way that shit set up, he telling. That nigga, damn. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, that shit, his whole situation crazy, dog. I ain't, but when he when t when he first came out, dog, I told all my brothers, I'm like, bro, this nigga's iffy, bro. Like I knew this, <laughs> I knew this whole time this man was getting extorted, bro. I swear to God, I was telling him this niggas before this shit even happened, bro. And like, sure enough, that shit happened. Like he had a good enough streak, bro. But you could tell, bro. Like you can't come into this industry, bro. Like and. You gonna get exposed, bro. Like he's going the down way, boy. Like he done so. I feel bad for that man to be honest. No but shit. that's what happened when you try to. You can't come in this shit with niggas you don't know, bro. You know what I'm saying? This shit not built for shit like that, bro. The industry will fuck you up, boy. Like I watched enough TV to know it, boy. So you know what I'm saying? And you know that's the crazy thing to me, dog. It's like this is one of them stories that a nigga that seen before but haven't seen before. You know, I was I was like waking up like, bro, this nigga gonna get smoked soon, and you don't yeah, wish bad yeah. on niggas, but you I'm like, but you just know it's, it's gonna like, happen. It's like, bro, doing. this nigga gonna get smoked soon. Like he ain't gonna be here too much longer. Like, cause what you doing now, you you ain't just disrespecting rappers, you disrespecting street niggas too. Right, fool. And and, it's really not rapping. It's not <laughs> rap. Yeah, and it's like you kind of taking it too far. So that, 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 that was really my thing. Like, I don't wish prison on the nigga, but when he was, like, disrespecting niggas, dead homies. Yeah, and that nigga was tweaking out, man. The shit he did in Chicago and played with them niggas. And I was just like, damn, yeah. this shit kind of going too far now, bro. Right, like, bro. You, when you were playing around, but it's like you making the shit personal. Yeah, it wasn't no explanation for what he was yeah. doing other than him having protection, you feel me? Like, <laughs> and, bro, that shit whack, bro. If you ever got to, like... Bro, if you gotta pay for protection, bro, then something ain't right, bro. Like, yeah. you need to stop moving how you moving, period, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Of course, to a certain extent, but he was getting fully extorted, bro. And you could tell from the jump, bro. Like, it was <laughs> yeah. a lot of niggas being blind to that shit, bro. Yeah. You could tell when this man first came out that he was a gimmick. You could tell once the nigga that came out behind him, once you seen him, you knew he was a real nigga. You see, like, <laughs> Come on, bro. Then the shit went platinum and, nigga, and everybody surprised. Niggas want to call out DJ Academics and shit, but yeah, man, I don't know that shit crazy. I bro. feel like it's everybody crazy. gotta take some blame now. I man. feel like to the the record label need to yeah. take a. I think they gotta split it all up to, yeah. in, in different forces. Takashi gotta take some blame because yeah. he a grown man. Yeah. I don't know why niggas want to call a twenty two year old a kid. Facts, now. I mean, he young. He young. He don't get me wrong. Grown man decisions for sure. Exactly. You make grown shit. man decisions. Hey, you done so. <laughs> and then you got. Uh, DJ Academics, right. you helped everything. you helped gas him up. Everything you helped place everything and everything he had to say. You made sure the hip hop, yo hip hop fans, got to see it. They got the information firsthand. They got exclusive information from you. That's crazy. You ate off that. You got big bread. You That's got crazy. rich. Off. You already was rich, right. but you really got a check. I bet you if that nigga, had, it became a point to where. About I know about seventy at least forty. Let me I don't at least forty percent of his platform became Takashi Six Nine. Nah, uh, facts. He definitely was like buddy buddy with yeah, this man did. made a song like basically copying the persona of this man, bro. Like, yeah, the game is so crazy. Bro, <laughs> man, like so, um, we had we we seen that go on, man, dog. and then at the same time, you gotta blame the Treyway crew. Yeah, they gave him the energy and the confidence to do it. 
Yeah, facts, you know but I mean, saying? shit, at the same time, I guess them was just like straight niggas being straight niggas. Well, yeah, that's what I say. I, yeah. I, I, I say, yeah, they, 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 they seen the lick. They yeah. seen the opportunity to get paid. Yeah. And it's like, fuck it, let's ride with it, nigga. Right. We, got, we got a nigga who gonna go get... Right. Fifty thousand a show, or whatever right. he was getting, and we could get some of that bread. Fuck yeah, it, we... they was milking his ass. I heard <laughs> something that said they was basically giving this nigga like three thousand and shit. Oh, probably on certain shit. Who knows how bad man, this that shit? Is, crazy, yeah. but I got family. But when I get on and I get scared, it's gonna be my cousin. <laughs> like, yeah, for like, real, like, my That's good cousin. Yeah, like, niggas you crazy. grew up with, and niggas but, that was on the come ground. On, with you. Come on, now. Come on, now. Yeah, that's what's up, man. Yeah, shit. Man. And then, you know, they, I just got to throw some, you know, the label ain't get no flack for that. Nah, hell nah. They never do. Yeah, That's they don't crazy. get no flack. It's crazy like a month. And they was supporting, mm-hmm. promoting, yeah. and all that shit for that. That's yeah. wild, man. Yeah, that shit crazy. That shit remind me of, like, how uh, when, them, when them niggas be getting traded in the NBA and they be saying the, uh, the owners trade them, but then when the tra- when the player asks for a trade, it's a problem and shit. <laughs> for real? That shit yeah, crazy, bro. Like, same shit. Same shit, dog. That's what's up.